All right, guys. It's the start of another day. Uh, it's November the twelfth or thirteenth. Not really sure. Don't really care. Uh, out on the trap line here again this morning, and uh, first trap check revealed a nice mink. Got this box set here, so I'm going to rebait there now with that chunk of muskrat and uh, get her set back up and see if we can pick up another one. Nice big buck mink. Yes, sir. Anyhow, we get this guy out of the trap, get reset, carry on. Day is young, so you never know. All right, guys, we're still chugging along on the trap line here and uh, picked up one mink so far. And I came across this set up here. Uh, right there is where I usually have a bottom edge set. It cuts in around that cliff there. And I got tied onto a brick. The brick is missing, but it's right there. And I don't know if you can see it, but looks like we picked up a nice big mink in this set. Oh yeah, real big dog. Yes, sir. So we get a ready set now, and uh, hopefully another one comes through. Okay, that's the set. Get down to the old book now. And it's all to it. Skirts around the edge of that cliff there and bang on. Then the trap. So anyhow, we carry on now and hopefully pick up another one. Alright guys, still carrying on, checking the line as we go along and uh, came across this setup here. And looks like we picked up another nice mink here. It's the second one for this set. Had one there the other day. So we get this guy out of the trap. Get the trap reset and carry on. It's number three for today, so we well, never know. Hey guys, today is November the 16th. Out on the trap line again today. Down here on uh, one of my walking lines here again now. And uh, I don't know if you can see it. There's a faint trail coming through there. And it crosses my path. And it ends up right there. <laughs> Nice lovely patch fox here. <clears throat> yes siree. Just nothing more than a just a baited rabbit trail. Or not baited I mean, just a set on a rabbit trail. Foxes are gonna follow the rabbit trails regardless, looking for the rabbits. So anywhere you can find a defined, well defined rabbit trail and makes it easier to set up a snare there. No bait required. All natural blind sets. Looks like we got a nice little cross fox again. Real nice cross. Get him on down here now. Garrett Brader was asking about scent control on the trap line. Well, as you can see, I do not wear gloves. I think uh, for snaring it's uh, highly overrated. I mean, I'm not sure and on bait and stuff and you then set in snares yes then it can become a problem because you're contaminating your snares with the scent and as for preparing snares usually I'll uh, make my snares in the spring dye them and about a month before trapping season everything gets over outdoors on the ground and takes on the natural smell but as for setting up snares and trying to control your scent, I think it's just a waste of time. 
traps, well, you got to be a little bit more careful because the animal is coming into a baited sit and he is sniffing. He's trying to figure out what's there, so you got to be more careful. So anyhow, get this guy out of there now, reset his snare air, and carry on. All right, guys, still carrying on on the trap line. Came across this 220 otter set up here, but looks like uh, picked up a big muskrat in it. So, put this guy up there now. Oh yeah, limo, real big rat. Anyhow, I get this guy out and get the trap reset and uh, carry on. You never knows, could be a good day, could be a not so good day. Just trapping, take each day as it comes and be patient and carry on. Alrighty, still continuing on to go here. I came across this setup. I don't know if you can see them down there, but uh, looks like we got a, another muskrat. Yes, sir. Turning that trap into a magnum trap seems to be paying off. Anyhow, I get this guy out, reset the trap. Hopefully, some more comes through. Well, guys. <coughs> We're still carrying on on the trap line here and uh, come across this 110 set up and it looks like we picked up another nice rat here. Yes sir. So I'll get this set back up here now and uh, hopefully some more comes through. Alright guys, still on the go here now. Uh, it's getting pretty late in the evening down to the last couple trap checks and uh, come across this uh, submarine cage here. And looks like we got a couple in there. And a trout. Oh yeah. A couple of trout there. We'll get them out, let them go. So anyhow, we'll check in later. Alright guys, this will be the last and final prep check of the day. So here we go. So I get them out, get the trap reset and uh, hopefully some more comes through. <laughs> 